Oh yeah, good fish. Oh, have a look at that. Oh yeah, finally. Have a look at that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is why I have an addiction. Second bait up. Nothing on the first bait. A little bit of reed around, but they're definitely fishable. And looks like I might be fishing with mainly pilchers tonight because I couldn't get any baby squid this trip. Always this time of the year they seem to become scarce. Must be um, I don't know whether it's when the trawlers work less or less squid around but anyway hopefully I can pick up a salmon or two for some fresh bait but yeah nothing wrong with the old pilly she um, she won the trip last trip pilly cleaned up got most of the fish in the last two trips so see how we go anyway might chuck a lure around and see if I can pick up some salmon. Hey, you bunch of legends, and welcome back to another episode. As you can see, I'm down this awesome place again, and the weather's not too bad. There's a lot of dark clouds around, and they reckon we might get some rain tonight, but so far, here on no wind. It's actually blowing a southerly, it's supposed to be blowing a northerly, I think, north northeast, but anyway. Bite southerly coming off the ocean, but calm as no bite so far. Uh, three bait ups I've had. Just about to chuck another one out. You know, I haven't seen any bites, but I reckon I got a bite earlier. Me rod was standing up a bit, but yeah, tide's on its way out. I think low tide's about seven or eight. Uh, high tide's about 12, 12:30 tonight. 
Uh, it's not a very big tide, only 1.2 or something. But I've caught plenty of good fish on small tides before. So yeah, anyway, get stuck into it. I reckon there might be a few fish around tonight. Uh, don't know how much of the moon we'll see with all this cloud, but you never know. It's going to be a glow from the moon. Anyway, we'll see how we go. Get stuck into it. Oh, this is um, one of the captures. I didn't see that in the last video, but yeah, pretty happy with the merch. I'll put a link below in the video if you want to check it out. Any support from my channel would be awesome. Anyway, you bunch of legends, I'll get stuck into it. See what we can come up with tonight. Yeah. I think I'm on to me about fifth bait now. I had a hit just before. I uh, threw the other rod out and then um, come over to this one, tighten her line up. Look over that one, she's standing up, ran it in, only a head left. So there's definitely fish out there. But, uh, yeah, just haven't hooked up yet. Could be some salmon. Yeah. We're on to something here. I don't know what it is. Bit of a dead. Might be a stingray or something. Yeah. I think it's a skate or Chabonet shark or something. He get off. Yeah, uh, skate. Escape, but I suppose at least, at least something, a bit of action. But there's no action, I suppose. Yeah, hopefully, we, um, how does that happen? Hopefully, we get onto something better now. Been pretty quiet up until about 10 minutes ago when I got smashed on that other rod. Something, something decent. It was either a big salmon or a good mully. The shit, the rod was bouncing, bouncing, and it went a bit, bit slack, and then it started bouncing again. And I got to the rod, and I felt, felt the uh, hook come out of its mouth. Spewing, she is a good fish. But anyway, I keep trying. Get onto something sooner or later, I reckon there's some good fish out there. Eww. Yes, on again. Oh yeah, good fish. Oh yeah. What do we got here? Whoa, whoa, yeah, good. 
head shakes there. It's either a gummy or a mully. Whoa, a bit of weight. Another gummy. Little fella. Tag and release this one. Have a look at that, finally landed a fish. Bringing about had four or five hit and misses. <coughs> Some of them were big hits too, but I'm gonna tag this girl, too small to keep. She's 87 centimeters. I reckon that's my 10th gummy shark that I've tagged in the last, since I started tagging. So, yeah, now coming up to a year, I think, but yeah, I'd like to be tagging more mullies, but couldn't get out in the boat this season, so next season's gonna be a ripper. I'll be tagging mullies galore, but better get this girl back anyway. Awesome catch, they put up a good fight, even the little ones. But yeah, great to finally get a <coughs> fish on the board. And uh, yeah, get another bait out. <coughs> Hopefully it's the start of many to come. Hopefully there's a few mullies around too. Yee Hopefully the first fish of many tonight. Come on little girl, let's go. There she goes. Yeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
So this is the rig that caught that 76 centimetre mile away. A bit kink now, but got um, 80 pound black magic fluorocarbon on the hook trace. The glow be there and three Tenno BKK octopus hooks um, and on the sinker trace it's a 60 pound black, ma black magic fluorocarbon and the swivel onto it's 80 pound braid on that rod that reel but um, the other one's only got 30 pound mono which is what I normally use but yeah that's the rig that does the job it's pretty consistent catcher for me and pillies are very consistent too once again nice fish on the pilly 76 centimeter mully this rig she catches mullet there's no doubt about it maybe not monster fish all the time but I'm always catching fish on it, so it's got to be something right about it. Anyway, we've still, still got a lot of hours yet. We'll keep this baiting up and chuck a bit of burly out. See if we can pull out a legal. Been a while since I got a good fish. Need some more gummies to be alright too. Had a few baby squid laying around the bottom of the bait bag, so we'll chuck on the squid, see how that goes. Philly's been doing alright so far, but yeah, we'll see how the squid goes. Pilcher one, there was just a tail left. And in the squid one, the squid was still there. Trust the old pilly. It's caught everything again tonight. Well, actually, we've got to give the squid a break. I've only just started it, trying it, but. A lot of people don't like using pilchard, but. I've always got a pilly out. As far as I'm concerned, it's one of my most consistent baits, that's for sure. Especially in the um, estuary. Caught so many big fish in the estuary on pilchard. And lyre baits too, but plenty on pilchard. Yeah, she's only about quarter to nine or something now. Quarter to nine, nine o'clock. Plenty of time left. Whoa! Oh shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, that's a big fish. Whoa, big head shakes. That's a good fish. Oh, wow. Big head shakes. Whoa, this is a good fish. This is a very good fish. Oh yeah, big head shakes. Oh. What do we got? Mulloway. Oh wow. Wow, 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 wow. Oh wow. Have a look at that. Oh yeah, can you believe that? On that big pilly I just chucked out. On that big pilly, have a look at that beast. Ah. 
I have a look at that. Eww. Oh, she wasn't getting off either. Have a look at that beast. Have a look at that, legends. 92 centimeters of silver. Eww. Have a look at that, you bunch of legends. Bit. This is why we fish. Fish like this is why we fish. Eww. What a beast. It's been a very quiet season for me and to get one right at the end, well, and towards the end of autumn, 92 centimeters, what a beast. Oh, I'm buggered. That's two good fish in one night. Unfortunately, I'm gonna to to take this one home, unfortunately for her, but because I've got no mother way in the freezer and it's been a very slow season. Got one bag of gummy shark, already released one gummy shark. Keep this girl to feed the family a couple of feeds. Ah, oh, it's gonna be well enjoyed, well worth the hours I've put in for it, I tell you. Put in a lot of hours for this fish. But yeah, what a beast. Eww. This is why I fish, this is why I have an addiction for these fish. Eww. Love it. What a fish. On the pilchard. Pilchard doesn't catch fish, eh? Look at that. Oh, I beg the differ. Eww. See my merch jumper here. Check out my merch shop, I'll be a, leave a link in the description of this video. Any support's appreciated. If you don't want to buy anything, that's cool. Thanks for watching anyway. Have a look at that, you legends. What a fish. Eww. Eww. Well, legends, bit of an update. She's uh, spitting with rain and the wind's picked up. But to tell you the truth, I couldn't care less. What a night. It was a slow start. I'll tell you what, I had four misses before I caught anything. Then I caught the um, small gummy shark. And that was a bit of a relief after catching nothing. Um, and then got the 76. I reckon I probably had half a dozen miss hits all night too. And then just called my wife and daughter, chucked the pilly out, bang, five minutes later she went off, 96 centimetre beast, uh, sorry, 92 centimetre beast, oh, I've been waiting for that fish for so long, I tell you what, it's been a very slow season without being able to fish in the boat, but uh, what a relief, two good fish in one night, I've had squid, baby squid out lately, haven't had a hit on them yet. Everything's been on the pilly. I uh, what it is when the weather seems to cool, when the weather cools down a bit. I don't know, they seem to like pillies better than squid. Maybe it's just luck. Maybe that's just what happens when I fish with them, I don't know, but I seem to do better with pillies in winter. Uh, yeah, late autumn, winter. But I'll tell you what's proving it right tonight. Good old trusty pilly, eh? But anyway, still got a few hours left. I'm excited. Anything I catch from now is a bonus. What a night. What a sesh. Unreal. It's like 20 degrees. It was beautiful. I was actually sweating. And uh, I tell you what, these... These, um... This uh, merch I got, the jumpers and the hoodies, they're warm as... Uh, yeah, they're good quality, they're good quality jumpers and that, that's for sure. Thick quality uh, material, but yeah, anyway, enough about that. I'll get stuck into it for the next few Check hours, see what else we can pull out. I buy anything I catch now is getting released with a tag in it. Well, I hope I get to Mulloway over 82 again, another Mulloway over 82, and I can tag and release me first Mulloway, but anyway. We'll keep assisting for another few hours in this spitting rain. Hopefully the wind doesn't get too strong. See how we go. Eww. 
Well, I'll tell you what, what a night. Very slow start to the night. I'll tell you what, last couple of hours, 76 centimetre mud away, a 87 centimetre gummy, and then a 92 centimetre mully. Oh, I've been waiting for this all season. I can't believe it's happened now. Mind you, I've caught some good fish at the end of May before. Yeah, trust the old pilcher though. Has squid out. Didn't get touched. Good old pilly. Trust the old Billy, eh? Comes through again. Two good Mulloway tonight, both on Billy. Couldn't be happier, finally! Get that big silver slab on the beach. Eww. I also like to give you another tip too. When you put the pilly on, put the hook just above the backbone of the fish. That's the firmest spot where it holds in the in the fish as far as I'm concerned. That one there is probably a little bit high actually, but still try and make it as straight as straight as possible. Above the backbone, best way it holds, I've found. Keep forgetting the burly up, haven't had a bite lately. Keep saying I'll, I'll burly up when I bait this one up and then I'll forget. You gotta, if you want to catch fish all night, you got to be consistent with your burly, consistent with your baits. It's the only way to catch fish down the beach. Oh, we're finally on to something else. Another salmon, maybe. Whoa. Is that mellow, eh? No, oh, it's got weed with it. Uh, big salmon, a decent sized salmon, do hey? Oh yeah, onto something bigger this time. Wow, well, just about to chuck out the other rod. Oh yeah, it might be another gummy, or it could be a mully. Good fish, real good fish. Come on, another gummy, bigger one. Yeah, wow, that bait was out there for ages. Yeah, <laughs> look at that girl. She's 97 centimeters. Amazing how long these little girls are. 97 centimeters. I kept that mully, so I said everything else I catch, I'm gonna let go. Tag and release, so eh? gonna tag and release her. Eh? What an awesome night! Two gummies, a skate, and two mullies, two stonker mullies. Oh, uh, what a sesh! Gotta be happy with that. What a night! Well, let her go get stuck back into it again. I mean, there's more fish around yet. See how we go. Yeah. Okay, boy. Here you go. Cheers. See you way, mate. See you next time. Yeah.
Here's cheers to all my legend supporters. Here's cheers to Mulloway fishing. It's night like nights like this that you never forget and keeps you coming back for more. This is definitely a night I'm never gonna forget, that's for sure. Two good sized Mulloway, a couple good gummies, good salmon, a bit of skate. What a session. In some pretty average weather. Well, it was nice weather today, but yeah, pretty crappy now. Anyway, still got a couple hours. Never know, we might pick up something else yet. Whew. Cheers. This spot keeps me coming back, I tell you. Bought some good fish here. Definitely glad I come back here tonight. Yeah. Damn it. Jeepers. Tell me the weed. Look at the weed have moved in. Look at that. My God. Uh, pretty well looks like the weed set in. I'm throwing out again now. The last two baits are threw out. Wound it in. Ton of weed on the sinker, ton of weed on the bait. Normally when that happens, she's all over Red Rover. But we'll see how we go. I'll try chuck out another bait now. Not liking me chances, but uh, I'll give it a go anyway. Well, you bunch of legends. Looks like that's about it for the night. And what a night. What a session. Very slow start of the night. I think I had four or five hit and misses before I even landed a fish. Which was the uh, gummy shark. The, small, the first one I got, the small one. Oh look out now, it's starting to rain on me. But yeah, then I got uh, the 76 centimetre mully on the pilly. Gumplet's first gummy was on the pilly in the 76, then the 92, then the good gummy, then the salmon, oh hang on, salmon and the gummy. But anyway, what an awesome nice fishing. This is why my channel is called Toddy's Mulloway Addiction, because this is what I live for. Why I fish, nights like this is why I fish. Anyway, enough of me dribble. So that's about it. Uh, what a night. What an awesome sesh. As far as I'm concerned by it, the rig I use, the rig I've um, chose to use with the glow bead and that, it, it works. It catches fish. So I keep using it. And pillies, very underrated bait. They caught all the good fish tonight. But yeah, thanks for watching, you bunch of legends. What an awesome night's fishing. Thanks for your support. If you want to check out my merch? I'll put the link in the description. Thanks for watching, you legends. See you in the next one soon. I'm looking forward to a good uh, winter season down the beach here in this area this is an awesome start like halfway through last month of autumn <coughs> and what a night but anyway see you next one soon you bunch of legends thanks for watching thanks for your support see you soon Yee!